All right. Just being nearby, Lotheb, causes your flesh to rot. So I recommend a melee class. <laughs> you would. All right. Necrotic Aura. Deal three damage to the enemy hero. Lotheb is a hideous reminder of the plague's effect on the creatures of Azeroth, and if we beat him, we get two Sludge Belchers, which are rare quality. And that means we would complete the wing, so we'll get Lotheb. So to defeat Lotheb, who's doing direct damage to our face, I think perhaps good old Zulok might actually be in order. Let's try it out. Let's see if it's a race. I see you. Your soul shall be mine. Mm, it is on curve. He's not doing direct damage with his hero power, so this could be okay. I greet you. You waste your breath. <laughs> Alright, that's a good draw for turn two. He has 75 health, not 30. Okay, so that makes this race a little more interesting. I don't definitely don't want to silence this. I want to kill it. Maybe I'll play this and then soul fire it. Alright, I'd rather d discard the owl than the harvest golem, I think. Unless he plays a bunch of big taunters. Dancing swords. Your opponent draws a card. Alright, let's see if harvest golem can take him out with the knife thrown by knife juggler. Alright. I think that's fine. Another knife juggler. And a great turn four setup. Alright. And a good turn five. Wow. That's handy. Hmm. Alright. Go for that. Keep our minions alive as long as possible. Deal 5 damage to a minion and summon a spore. What does a spore do? Death Rattle, give all enemy minions plus 8 attack. So... Yeah, this seems fine. <laughs> so now I have a 12-4 and a 12-1. Sorry, a 10-1. Poison seeds? I just got these guys. That's so rude. Still gonna hit him for six. Actually, I'm still gonna hit him for eleven. I guess I'm glad you didn't poison seed Doomguard. This makes another spore. Maybe able to grind him down without hitting any spore creatures. Ah, here are the big taunters. I expected. Alright. Now if he makes a spore out of Haunted Creeper, that'd be pretty good. Oh no! Of course, he targets the largest thing. But that's okay, I'm about to have a lot of minions with a lot of attack. So, we can break the spore now and do a ton of damage. And then Void Terror. <laughs> that'd be pretty hilarious. As you are. Actually, yeah, that seems fine. Let's do it. Actually, if this death rattle triggers first, no, no, we're fine. Look at where they ended up going positionally. That's very interesting. Poison seeds. All right. Deal one damage. 
damage. Whoa. What was that? Spore burst. Deal one damage to all enemy minions and summon a spore. Well, you're actually dead this turn now. Go ahead and pop that. And we'll hit him for 60. <laughs> so Zulok appears to be just fine for normal Lothab. Stop it! Stop it right this minute! And that's Lotheb defeated. We got two Sludge Belchers added to our collection. They're a 3 5 taunt with Death Rattle, summon a 1 2 slime with taunt. So it's kind of like a Harvest Golem. Um, but it spits out a Northshire Cleric instead of a 2 1 damage Golem. <laughs> uh, that's pretty good against Zoo and Miracle Rogue and Burst combos because they not only have to get through Sludge Belcher, but then the 1 2 taunt that he leaves behind. So that's the normal next Ramus wing. Let's see if Kel'Thuzad has anything to say about our rewards. Quake Quarter defeated. Lotheb. 5-5 five, five or 5. Battle cry. Enemy spells cost 5 more next turn. And we've got now a Mage and Hunter class challenge to check out. You can also attempt the insanely difficult Heroic Plague Quarter. Thanks very much for watching everybody, that is the normal Plague Quarter for the Naxxramas adventure.